Hey, it's great to be with you again today. Uh, most of you know that I've been working with my friend in wastewater management this summer. And um, so we covered nine houses today, right? Hit, uh, my buddy, his daughter, myself, we, we were doing this whole neighborhood. So we hit five houses. And let me tell you what, it wasn't like super sunny and the sun wasn't beating down, but it was humid and we were sweating and stinking and this is what I looked like, right? So we got done work and he goes, hey, do you want to go grab something to eat on the way home? We're like, yeah. And there was this pretty cool looking restaurant. He goes, oh, you got to try this, this lobster bisque. It's awesome. So we're like, okay, cool. Let's go in, right? So we, we pull up and we're sitting in the parking lot and uh, his daughter and I get out of the truck and we're standing out front talking and he's in the truck and uh, uh, the manager comes out and she says, um, excuse me. Um, are, were you going to come in and, and eat? And we're like, well, well, yeah, we were going to come in. And she's like, ah, uh, you're okay. And he points to the girl, the daughter. And then she points at me and she says, you, you can't come in. You don't have any sleeves on your shirt. And so we start laughing, right? Because I'm like, what in the world? You know, we, I mean, we had been standing out in the parking lot for 10 minutes waiting for them to open up. And, and now she comes out and says, now, you know, everybody else can come in, but sorry, fella, you don't make the grade. So I started to think about that. And one of the things that, you know, I, I have no problem with, right? Let's, let's be clear about that. I have no problem because I didn't match their dress code, but in our regular everyday lives, how often do we treat people like that? You don't reach the standards for me, so sorry, you're out. You're not going to be included. You're not smart enough. You're not funny enough. You're not pretty enough. You're not whatever enough to hang with the cool kids, right? And because of that, sorry, you know, I'm just going to walk away. I'm just not going to call them. I'm not going to include them in the event or the party or the whatever. And the golden rule says that we're supposed to treat other people the way that we want to be treated. Jesus says, love each other the way that I love you. Not because they can do something for you. Not because you might be able to get something from them. Love them because... Well, you love them. Treat them like they mean something. Like they're a person that is worthy of love, of being accepted, of being a part of the family of God. Because each and every one of us are created in God's image. May God continue to pour out his grace, mercy, and blessings on each and every one of us. Until we get to meet again. Amen? Amen. I'm going to go get a shower now.